Welcome, my name is Isaac Max, and in this video, I will be showing you how to auto save a new contact. Okay, it could be a WhatsApp contact or um, a call contact. So, we are going to be using this app called Auto Save Contact. Okay, I'm going to drop the link so you can download this app. So, just check the description of this video, I'll be dropping the link where you can download this app. Okay, so I'll click on it. So you have to sign in into the auto save contacts okay you can do that by entering your name your country code and your phone number okay you can also sign in with your google account so now you have to grant the auto save contacts access to your contact okay so this will help um, the auto save contacts to be able to save contacts directly into your um, phone contacts so just click on allow now allow the auto save contact access to your phone calls now if you turn this on and the number calls you the auto save contact will save that contact automatically okay so if you don't want the auto save contact to save um, contact for phone calls just click on deny and we have allow contact to your call logs so i'll just deny this and we have the option to give the auto save contacts access to our data okay so i don't think this is necessary so i'll just click on deny if it is necessary as time goes on we'll know about that okay so um just click on cancel so now let's go ahead and set up the auto save contacts so clicking on this menu icon we have the go pro option now this um, account is already on pro and if you want to get your account on pro just check around this video and i'll be showing you how to do that okay so just go back so we have the settings now for the auto save contacts to function very well i will advise you turn on these three options here okay to store unknown contact from whatsapp just click on yes and give the auto save contacts access to your notifications okay so this will enable the auto save contacts to detect new messages from unknown contacts okay so just go ahead and turn this on now if you want to get notified before saving a new contact just go ahead and turn this off but if you want it to be automatic you can just leave it as turned on okay so apparently you have to turn on these three options for the auto save contacts to function very well and automatic now the next step to take is to create a group okay clicking on this plus icon you can give your group a name depending on what you want to use it for for example i use my brand name ism so any contact saved will be saved numerically for example ism1 ism2 ism3 and so on and so forth okay so depending on the purpose you want to use your group for for example let's say you want to host a graphics class you can just name your group as graphics now you can have as many groups as possible but in order for that group to be functional you have to select it as the default group now to do that just click hold on your selected group and select as default group okay now this tick here is showing that this is the selected group okay so click holding on the group again we have the option to send bulk sms to the total number of contacts saved in that group so using this option we can see we can send bulk messages to all the contacts saved okay so you can see within few minutes i've saved two contacts saved as graphics one and graphics two so this method is very beneficial because you relieve yourself 
of the stress of saving contacts one after the other okay so another thing you want to take note of is that you want to ensure that the people you save their contacts also save your own contacts okay and that is when you need an auto response okay in my other video i'll be showing you how to do that and if you have a group let's say a group of 250 members for example and you want to save their contacts now let's say you decide to extract those contacts using an extractor now not all of them will reciprocate by saving your own contact also and this is kind of worthless because you also want them to save your contact now instead of using an extractor you can decide to send them a message in the group that okay send me your name in your dm so that i can save your contact now immediately a new person sends you a message is going to automatically save their contact as graphics one graphics two graphics three and so on and so forth so this method this app is great and i'm sure you are going to enjoy it now what can make this app to pause or stop working now one of the reasons is if you do not turn on all the tabs from your settings page also you have to check from your mobile settings and ensure that this app have access to unrestricted data and unrestricted battery usage okay ensure that the app is not optimized ensure that it is not push blocked and etc etc all these things that i mentioned can make this app to pause or stop working for some time okay so when you set up all these things i'm sure you are going to enjoy efficient use of this app thank you very much my name is isaac matt see you in another video bye